Hey guys, welcome back to another reaction, and today I'm here to Jujutsu Kaisen episode 20, and yeah, my boy Itadori, well, the brothers Itadori and uh, Toto, they were just going crazy last episode, especially that one part, yo, that animation turned up like, yo, what? Like, when I saw it, I was like, yo, hold up, like, I did not know what to say right there, because it bro it's like they were just going at it right there but um yeah and then they had the black flash too nah bro but um yeah i, I, I think uh itadori has a new move he can use consecutively now that well if he doesn't get too angry like how he did uh, right before total uh slapped him and made him uh come to his senses but yeah um his new black flash technique or whatever but um yeah besides all that let's just see what's gonna happen now um against that one special grade i, th I, I forgot their name it started like an m or something i'm we're gonna find out or i'm gonna find out anyways um but yeah i hope you guys will enjoy this though make sure to like and subscribe and yeah let's get this reaction started Brand new whip, got no keys. Tell them I close, no stash, please. Soon as I, you can go, leave. Got M's in the bank, like S and D. Cardiac glasses, I won't even peek at you. Yellow Ferrari, like Pikachu. I got on waiting and watching what he gon' do. Trying to pee what I do, trying to steal my move. Okay. Yo, hold up. What's going on? Wait, what? I beat up a cocky high schooler. Oh, I thought that was him getting beat up. Um, and like basically it shows um even if he was holder, cocky is still cocky. Okay, so he said Yo Toto did not care. He said if you if you were you were cocky, I will just beat you up, bro. I don't care how old you are. Yo, okay, but I thought that was Toto getting beat up by someone else, and basically they were gonna show us like how why he's so like strong right now. Oh, okay, hold up. So wait, let me let me see that again. So that's she asked what type of woman was your type. So is that where he got it from? Oh, okay, we I think we're gonna get some backstory on Toto this episode because. Yeah, it, it looks like we're, we're going to be getting some backstory on him because I think that's where he got that um question from. Yo, okay. I, 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 can, I can see it a little bit now. Okay. But yeah, let's get to this um episode. Yo, this dude total analyzed her for real. Yo, even as the names for the attacks and everything. Yo. This dude right here. Okay, possibility that all of those are bluffs. Okay. So basically, um, it's like she's doing all that, but it's basically she has like one big weakness or something. My, okay, IQ 530,000. Okay. Yo, yes, you are not alone, my guy. Yo, so they went from friends to brothers in like two seconds. <laughs> okay. <laughs> he did all that analyzing and she still got him. Yo. <laughs> Yo. Okay. Yeah, go help out your brother. Okay. Oh, yes. Technique. Okay, so he can switch him out. Okay, I like it. Oh, and he just punched him because he was about to punch her. Okay. I like it. So, yeah, that is what his technique is. He basically, my technique swatched my position. Okay. <laughs> Boogie woogie. What? <laughs> Yo. <laughs> okay, what type of name for a technique? Okay, but I like it, though. That's actually pretty... So all he has to do is just clap his hands. He can just switch position. Oh, that's fire, actually. Yo. 
I was about to say that's smart because he can switch out. Like if he's about to die, he could just switch with them, and then he would make them in a, a near death situation. But he no, this is fire right here. Oh okay, nah, bro. Yo, those facial expressions that he makes every time he claps too. Okay. Yo, this <laughs> this seems a little overpowered right now. Especially if she, if she couldn't regenerate, it would be over, bro. Okay. Oh, Black Flash consecutively. Yeah, they did talk about that. Record holder for consecutive Black Flash uses. Wait, hold on. Let me see what it says. Uh, Nanami is um who <laughs> has the current record. Though it is difficult to produce more than twice in a row or on a different day, it doesn't matter if you land the first by fluke or skill. Okay. So once they land, sorcerers temporarily enter a state athletes call it a zone. Okay. Or athletics. Whatever he said. Um, okay. But yeah, they talked about that. Um using a consecutive isn't that easy or whatever so i guess um okay his record so how many times four times okay yeah that yeah it seems like you can't do it um as many times at once and successfully uh landed okay Oh, he did it with a kick. Okay, I I know if you I know you could um black flash with a kick too. Oh, he did three in a row. Hold up, two more and he's gonna beat Nanami's record. Okay. Oh, wait, was that a? Oh, he just regularly clapped. Yo, doesn't necessarily mean I'm, yeah, he just regularly did it. Yo, I thought, I thought she was about to get the drop on him, though. Um, I thought he was about to get, the, or she was about to get the drop on uh, Itadori, though. But nah, he said, nope, I'm just, I just clap my hands. I ain't use my, I ain't use my technique, I just clap my hands. What you looking at me for? Hey, Itadori is right there behind you still. Oh, yo, this is the type of fight I like right here, though. Oh, okay. Yeah, th just this right here is just <laughs> the main reason why I like Jujutsu Kaisen. Like, it's just, oh, okay. Oh, she uh, punched him, too. Okay. I thought uh, Toto was going to uh, switch Itadori back again. And is, but that black flash rush hurt it, okay? Oh, he used the black flash again, okay. But, um, is there a limit to how many times he can use his technique? Because Toto, that, that's kind of overpowered, though. You, you can't even lie about that. That is, that is going to be kind of overpowered. Nah, bro. On top of how strong Toto is, too, like, he just swap you out. Whenever, my guy. Okay, he can repel these buds, okay? So he just hardens his body with this curse energy then. Okay, hold on. Are we gonna see some... Oh, no, that's just... Okay. I was about to say, are we about to see some more um backstory? But it's just Takata. Okay. Happen in point zero... Y'all know good and well that did not happen in no point zero one seconds. <laughs> Yo, that was a good um one minute flashback or no not flashback like what just a moment he usually would probably have. Okay, whatever. With like Takata. Okay, cause I know that was just <laughs> completely his imagination right there. Okay. It works on cursed corpses and inanimate objects. Okay, yeah, that that 
Uh, yeah, that is kind of overpowered then, if you think about it. Because <laughs> if he's an inanimate object, this dude can have a store, a store, a sword just um sticking out of nowhere, right? And then easily swap them to where he is, and then just push him into the sword and just cut him like that. Okay. Yo, hold up. That, that boy total gone clean with that um curse tool, my guy. Yo, it look like you got a good hit. Okay. Yeah, they completely it ain't uh completely take it down. Okay, what's this doing with this um arm? Yo, the trees just withered. Yo. <laughs> Wait, hold up. I don't know what type of attack is about to do. My left arm steals the life from plants and converts it into cursed energy. Okay. That's actually pretty smart. Um, because someone could be hiding up in a tree and you just take all the energy and then bam, you just shoot at them, right? Because the trees just withered down. So, yeah. Yeah. Um, <laughs> yeah, you better stay away, my guy. Because, yeah, that looks like it's about to do a lot of damage to you if you get hit by that. Is that Gojo? I knew it, bro. I could literally see his white hair, even if he was like that small. Yo, what? Oh, he's still over here on the guitar. Okay. Yo, what did he do? Okay, this dude Gojo just broke the veil or veil. Like what? And she was about to do domain expansion too. He said no, bro. I'm going to stop that right here. Yo, who is that? Yo. Hold up. Where did this dude come from? What? Okay. Did this dude just up and run? What? Okay, I mean... I thought we was going to have a whole nother, like, really strong person. It's just... Okay. Apparently, he's weak. So, this dude with the axe just gave him a sword. Oh, yeah. I just realized this dude is flying. Yo. Okay. Oh, he realized um, Itadori is on a higher level. Okay. Oh, and I... Yeah, I guess you can see his power, too. A great match for... Okay. Yo, how did... They... His priority should be... Him? Yo! Yo! What did he just do? Oh, I thought he cut, like, his arms off or something. Now he just... He broke his bones? What? Yo! So I guess he thought that Itadori and, um, the guy, it, or, um, Itadori and Toto are fighting. He was like, okay, yeah, those two are fine. So I should go check up on the, uh, on the principal. <sighs> okay. I don't know what this dude Gojo just did, but... Curse technique ampli amplification blue and that red that he used before? Yo, what? <laughs> they said I'm not stupid enough to fight against Gojo. Okay. Yo, even Toto could feel that. Hold up. How strong is the Gojo? What? Oh, okay. It would have hit past him if he uh, would have went forward. Yo. This dude. Oh, yeah. It's a door. He definitely would have been obliterated from that. Yo. I'm still stuck on the fact on what this dude just did to that guy with the axe. 
bro, his bones are like completely shattered. Like what? Yo. Oh, he took a finger. Okay, and I meant to say Hanami. Not uh, it starts with an M, and I'm guessing. Yeah, they got a little shorts at the end. I, I really haven't been watching those lately. I think I missed like a good four or five. I used to watch like every single one. I just you like literally right now. I like or um after each episode, I just simply. Uh, finish the reaction up and then just edit and upload that's really all i do after that but um yeah pretty good episode this dude gojo i bro i can't bro what <laughs> okay this dude literally broke not not only broke the veil because i'm pretty sure he did that he combined that like red technique that he used against a uh, Jogo, and combined some like blue thing, and <laughs> made purple. Obviously, he just mixed colors. It literally, this dude is mixing colors and literally causing all this damage. Like what? Um, and he shattered a man's bones. Like what? Like arms and legs. Like l let me look at that again. Like. He is not recovering from that. Like, he's not. They literally look like... It's like his skin isn't torn off. But you can literally see. The, the bones are just... They're not there, bro. <laughs> like, not... Well, I mean, they're still there. But y'all know what I mean. Like... Okay. <laughs> Yo. That, that was something else right there. But, um, yeah, I hope you guys did enjoy this. Make sure to like and subscribe again. And, yeah, I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye.